As cats go, Turkish Angoras are said to be dog-like. Some respond to voice commands and even play fetch. And they're one of those ancient cat breeds. Legend holds that Muhammad owned and adored a white Angora. This breed was attractive to uh, French royalty because of their very beautiful, uh, gracious appearance with this long coat. What? They talk a lot, and they're helpful. They're best known in white, but we have been breeding colored Turkish Angoras for many years. These sleek, plush cats were first noticed centuries ago in the snowy, rugged mountains of Angora, Turkey, now known as Ankara. The long hair developed probably because of the coldness of the climb. In fact, some scientists believe the Turkish Angora is the originator of the long hair gene in all cats. It's hard to say which Angora characteristic captivated humans the most. Maybe it's the signature long, silky coat or its large almond-shaped eyes. These come in virtually any color, gold, green, blue, and sometimes more than one color on a single cat. Oftentimes you have deafness on the side where there's blue and hearing on the side where there's color. Angoras are also known for their large tufted ears and their long, finely boned legs and sleek bodies. I like to describe the structure of a Turkish Angora as a ballet dancer. They're long, elegant, fine-boned, graceful, beautiful cat. This is Mopar. OK, maybe they're not all light on their feet. He's my boy, you know. Even though he's 38 and a half pound kitty, he's still my baby boy. He's 38 and a half pounds and three and a half feet long. He's my cat, and I love him. Mopar gets his name from the parts his owners use in their race cars. At three years old, he tipped the scales at 16 pounds. Pam and Kurt never exceeded their cat food guidelines, but at four, he was 20 pounds. We give him just a small amount of food. He only gets fed twice a day, but he still manages to put on the weight. He was tested for thyroid, kidney, and liver abnormalities by two vets. Their conclusions? You just have a big kitty, Pam. And I said, yes, I do. I have a very big kitty. Now eight years old and nearly 40 pounds, Pam continues to worry about Mopar's health. The weight does put a strain on every organ in his body. And that kind of scares me a little bit. Desperate for clues to Mopar's girth, two weeks ago, the Williamsons sought the advice of yet another vet. Hi, and Mopar and me are here to see Dr. Arns. My initial reaction when Mopar entered my exam was that, my goodness, this is easily the biggest cat I've ever seen in my life. They performed a third thyroid test, and the Williamsons were told to cut Mopar's food to just one half cup daily. Today is Mopar's follow-up visit. Uh, hello, Mopar. Usually I can feel just about every nook and cranny, not Mopar. But once again, thyroid tests are negative. Hi, Mopar, let's listen. Puzzled, there's still one more test to try, and it's the simplest. We're gonna see what Mopar weighs today. That's right, official weight. Then suddenly, a break in the case. He's lost a pound. Lost two pounds, actually. Yeah. yeah. So, wow. So that's good news. For three more weeks. Mopar's new food quota is having an effect. Brought tears to my eyes, boy, yeah, made me yeah. very happy. And we likely need to look into this a bit more. Mopar will still get more tests to see if genetics or hormones play a role. But Arn suspects Mopar has been overfed for years. He adds the Williamsons are not to blame. Like a lot of pet owners, they were just following directions on the cat food bag. I've never been a fan of the feeding guides on cans and, and bags. I look at the results. If the pet who's put on my table is huge and yet it seemingly is getting very little food, it's probably more than your pet needs. Good news. Fantastic. So how do Turkish Angoras stack up to other breeds? Well, despite their long hair, Angoras don't need much grooming. Overall, the Turkish Angora is a healthy breed that can live 15 to 20 years. But because many cats are difficult to exercise, Experts say they need to be watched for signs of weight gain. 
The overweight cat is more likely to develop diabetes, as well as heart, kidney, muscle, and bone problems. And some say Turkish Angoras are simply the best cat for a family with small children. Generally speaking then, the Turkish Angoras are healthy cats that can live a long time. They require very little grooming. Their good nature makes them great with families.